am I doing? Uh, and I asked her about that, and she said, well, this is the sixth of six races that she's running on this tour of the U.S. I saw her back at the Fryhoffers Run for Women on June 5th. That was at the other end of this series of six races. And sometimes you get the great idea, or maybe not so great idea, to run this 15K in suits and hats. Joe Kelly with more on that. Yeah, well, we've got a familiar-looking uh, duo here, the Blues Brothers, otherwise known as John Health and Matt Health, and they're from up in the Boonville area. Well, you're not exactly in Boonville. What's like? And you're from? Boonville. Boonville. And uh, i got to ask you, how, I know how it's to run this race on a hot day in shorts and a singlet, but I don't know what it's like to run it in a suit. We say we're naturally cool, so it doesn't really bother us. <laughs> how is the heat out there, Matt? Uh, it wasn't bad. I mean, if we ran it a couple days ago, I know we'd be hurting, but we seemed to do pretty good. Uh, cloud cover. It was good to have the cloud cover big time. But. And when you guys came over, what? Did you notice your time when you came over, John? Again, no, we didn't look. No. Okay. It takes us back away, so it takes us a while to cross the starting line, so it takes us a little longer to cross the finish line. Yeah. <laughs> Matt, I got to believe you got a good reaction from the crowd. Oh, always, always. The crowd pushes us. And then if we're in with a, a pack, we push that pack, too, so it kind of complements each other. So it works. It all works. All right. John and Matt helped from Boonville, and uh, they ran it as the Blues Brothers, guys. Wow. Is it sad that they just ran 9.3 miles in full suits, and I'm actually perspiring more than they are, and I sat here the whole time? No, no. 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 We're, we're in front of these hot lights, Mark. Uh, so, yeah, yeah. The TV, we, the lights. We have yes, an thank excuse. You. Thank you. Uh, I needed help on that one. Uh, uh, just, you know, that's what makes it fun. Like we said before, the cast of characters. To be able to do that uh, for 9.3 miles and to have a smile on your face and to do an interview, uh, I'm sure they got the crowd ignited every time they ran through a section of this race. Something we should also mention, what was the best part of this race from a fan perspective? Well, we'll find out. It seems that West Utica, I think they won this thing. I, I lost it in my pile of notes here.